Dakota Access Pipeline is still going to go underneath Lake Oahe. They are not going to listen to the Army Corps of Engineers denying the easement. They don't care about that. They're still going to go ahead. Now, a lot of people here at camp are celebrating. They're very happy. And I mean, I was too when the announcement came yesterday. But we need to realize today that the company, Energy Transfer Partners, does not care about the uh, easement being denied. They're going to go ahead and drill on anyways. Hi, my name is Artie. I'm with the Lakota People's Law Project. It was just announced earlier today that Energy Transfer Partners is going to go underneath Lake Oahe. Um, and this is in defiance of the Army Corps of Engineers making the statement yesterday uh, that they are denying the easement. So a lot of people here at camp are celebrating. They're happy. There were fireworks last night. Our Shambo, the chairman, said yesterday that we can now all go home to our families. That's not true. We cannot go home to our families because the pipeline is not stopped. They're still planning to go underneath the lake in defiance of, our, of Army Corps of Engineers. So we need to stand strong together. If you're here listening to this, please come join your brothers and sisters here. We need numbers, okay? So we stand strong together, we can defeat this pipeline. Um, well, I just want to let people know and remind people that Sunoco, the future pipeline uh, operator, um, has spilled crude oil more than any of its competitors more than 200 times since 2010. That's about once a week they spill crude oil, okay? And in the United States in total, since 2010, there have been more than a thousand crude oil spills. Okay? And crude oil spills, I, don't, I feel like I don't need to tell you guys this, but when it spills, it's releasing toxic chemicals. And these toxic chemicals affect the drinking water of the people not only in this tribe, at the San Roxy tribe, but also millions of people downstream. A lot of people do not uh, rely on this uh, reservoir here, uh, Lake Oahe, one of the biggest reservoirs on the Missouri River for, for drinking water. And uh, if they build this pipeline, it's, it's going to eventually spill. It's not really a matter of uh, if it's going to spill, it's a matter of when it's going to spill. Why world see?